Blockchain.com. Hum, 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 hum. I assume that one of the ways free thinking Japanese were able to determine that they were losing World War II was the following way. In fact, probably almost anyone could figure it out. All you really had to do was listen to uh, the, the, uh, the locations of the victories that were being broadcast by the propaganda arm. So, in the war with the Americans, the first glorious victory, of course, was at Pearl Harbor in Hawaii, and the second glorious victory was at Midway, closer to Japan, and then there was a victory at Guadalcanal, still closer to Japan, and, and then there were victories in places like, uh, I don't know, Guam, the Philippines, Saipan, the Okinawa, and finally, they were winning above Tokyo. Well, in the same way, you can sort of listen to what the opponents of the Free State Project have to say. First, the Free State Project wasn't going to get even off the ground. Then, according to one New Hampshire political professor, we weren't going to get much traction because there would be too much infighting since we were libertarians. Uh, then they, they weren't going to be accepted because they were from other places. Then, okay, some of them might be accepted, but they're not going to get elected because they're from other places. And then, well, the ones that are elected, they're probably not really going to be able to be effective in their agenda of cutting the state budget. Oh, and then it was, well, they were not, they're not going to be able to cut the state budget again. Followed by, they're the biggest threat to the state of New Hampshire. But we'll get them by exposing them. Followed by, oh, I can't believe the city of Keene just fell into the Free Staters' trap by prosecuting them and giving them so much free exposure on CBS and CNN. There was, oh, the Free Staters are just on the internet, they're just an internet thing. There was, oh, there's no way they're really going to get 20,000 signers to move to New Hampshire. Then, oh, well, if they get 20,000, they, they, won't, they won't get it on time. Uh, oh, uh, and they, they, won't, they won't all move. Well, actually, before that, it was, it was more like uh, a lot of them won't move. And then it was, uh, oh, all of them won't move. Then it was, oh, my God, there are way too many of them here. What are we going to do? We must organize to defeat them. It's the authoritarians' language of defeat, much like Tojo's. Well, of course, free staters, too, can be guilty of the language of defeat. Uh, activist Daryl Perry and Keene was upset about some shenanigans that had been pulled against free staters or uh, maybe some negative publicity the other day and his post was this is effing bullshit see the way I look at it getting angry and talking like that gives aid and comfort to the enemy accidentally you think seeing you rattled is something they don't want we should be letting them be rattled and just focus on moving the ball forward as fast as we can or stopping it from moving backward as best we can. It's nice to see that although we can't win a lot of battles deep in enemy turf yet, by and large, the ball has been moving forward. We're getting closer to Tokyo. Blockchain.info's free Bitcoin web wallet, chock full of privacy and security features, Two-factor authentication, a second password for sending coins. They never have control over your passwords or your coins. They don't even require your personal info. Get yours today at blockchain.com. Hum, 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 hum.